out of coffee let's uh fuel the rest of the day with anger today we have a new video from the house commons debate Candace versus trudeau new evidence has come up at the rcmp in terms of trudeau spending taxpayers money to go on a holiday we all know he does that he goes to whistler he goes to tofino two places i frequent a lot yet i'm not the prime minister should he be doing that i don't know should he be spending our money to go on vacation i don't know watch clip knew there was a loophole that he could have used. As silly as it might sound, the Prime Minister could have written himself a note, given himself permission to take the holiday. So my question is this, did the Prime Minister give himself permission to take that free <laughs> holiday in 2016? No, there's no way he would have done that, right? We know he doesn't ask for permission. He uh, apologizes later, right? It's better to ask for forgiveness than for permission is Trudeau's mentality. Um, hey, if there's money on the table, he might as well take it and go surfing or go snowboarding, right? No, Mr. Speaker. This matter was settled years ago when the Ethics Commissioner re released the report. While the Conservatives continue to focus on petty politics and on me, we're going to continue to focus on Canadians, on investing in housing across the country, in $10 a day childcare for families, in continuing to lead on world-class investments in fighting climate change. That is what Canadians expect of us. That is what we continue to do. This one hits home because when he talks about childcare, I got a kid on the way in of October. My girlfriend and I are pregnant. Well, she's pregnant, but woke culture, we're pregnant. You know, affordable childcare is like, yeah, for sure, I would like that. But no, 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 Mr. Trudeau, I know what you're doing. You're not gonna win me over with that. I don't think so. Because uh, I mean, might be paying ten dollars a day in childcare, but then you're gonna come to my house and beat me with batons with your little NATO police, right? No, 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 Mr. Trudeau, no, fall on for it. Why do we keep focus on it, Trudeau? Because you're an idiot. You don't know what you're doing. You spend our money to go do things that only benefit you. You have a job, you're on a salary, you get benefits. Go to work every day like the rest of us. Do your job. Stop spending our money to go on these retreats. Stop taking our money to go fund your renovations and your houses, all right? Holy smokes, man. Politics is stressful. It's stressful, man, but like it's helping me slow down on coffee. I'm drinking less coffee. I'm consuming more politics. The equilibrium is doing this, right? More coffee, less politics, more politics, less coffee. Because I need to be angry all day. And this is a great way to do it. The moment I say, the moment I see Trudeau's face, it's like, oh, come on. This guy's still here? I thought that was a nightmare. Like and follow for more. See you next time. Sorry? <laughs> I thought I was going to make it through this, but I'm not. It hurts. Emotional damage!